So one of the hardest parts about using Bricklink Studio to build Lego models is just learning how to manipulate the Lego pieces in virtual space. So used to clicking things together with our hands, switching over to using a mouse and a computer can be a little tricky, but here's the way that I learned how to do it. All you need is a small Lego set, just a, a medium-ish size set. So what I've got here is Boba Fett's Micro Fighter. I'm gonna go to Bricklink Studio and you can actually import entire Lego sets. So now I've got a PDF for the instructions, I've got the physical pieces to this Lego model, and I've got my digital Lego model. There aren't really that many controls to Studio. You basically have the arrow keys for changing the orientation of a piece. Uh, you have WASD for uh, moving things around, up, down, left, right. And there is the mouse hand. You scroll in, scroll out, you zoom in, zoom out, you move around, that moves the cursor. And if you right click, that changes the uh, perspective. And if you hold down on the middle wheel and move on, then you, you move, you do that. The thing about having a physical version of it is I can understand what I'm doing here with my hands as I build. And if I get stuck in the computer, uh, it's just really nice to have that reference. There's a lot going on here, so this is a good way to ground what you already know with what the uh, new thing you're doing is. Hopefully this helps you get started with Studio. There's so much to learn about using the software, but I, I think this is a good trick for people getting started uh, with it.